So today we're going to demonstrate difference in heat and glare control between two identical fabrics. First we're going to test out the black fabric and the only difference between these two is going to be one is going to have a metalized back on it and one's going to be without. And then we're going to do the same experiment with the white colors and one is also going to have the metalized back on it and one will not. We're going to test the heat gain by using our thermometer and we're also going to test the amount of sunlight that's coming through the fabric by using our lux meter. Now, because we can't get a sun in here, we're going to use a halogen lamp, which does give out a lot of heat and a lot of direct light. So we're going to begin by testing out the black fabrics first, and this one's not going to have any metalized back on it. So we're just going to set it right there and get the benchmark temperature that's currently in the room using our thermometer. So right now, we're sitting at about 24.8 degrees. So we're going to leave it there for about 20 seconds. And to simulate our sun, we're going to use the halogen lamp. And using our lux meter, we're going to measure how much light is coming through the fabric. So right now we're sitting at about 248 times 10 lux. So naturally darker fabrics are known to hold on to a lot more energy. So after about 20 seconds, if we measure the temperature of the fabric, you're going to see that we're going up to 45.2 degrees. Now we're going to do the same experiment using the same kind of fabric, but this one is going to have a metalized back on it. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to measure the amount of light that's going to come through the metalized backing fabric. And as you can see, you're not going to see much of a difference here since darker fabrics are known to hold on to a lot more heat. So we're sitting about 239 lux times 10. And if we take our temperature, you're going to see a big difference when it comes to the reflective back. This one's sitting at only about 28.6 degrees in comparison to our 46 with the previous fabric. Now we're going to do the same experiment using our white fabric and this one is not going to have any metalized backing on it. So what we're going to do is we're going to start by measuring the light that comes through the white fabric using our lux meter. So white fabrics are known to cause a lot more of a glare problem since they let a lot more light through. So right now you can see that we're sitting at about 1165 lux times 10. So in terms of temperature you won't see a big of a difference since light fabrics don't absorb that much heat as the darker fabrics do. So the temperature is sitting right now at about 29.6 degrees. Now we're going to do the same kind of experiment with our metalized back fabric. So we're going to set it right there and take the lux meter to measure how much light is coming through our fabric that has a metalized back on it. So here you'll see quite a bit of a difference since we're comparing it to 1100. Right now we're currently at 267 lux times 10, which you can see is a quite a significant difference compared to the one without the metal ice back on it. And again, in temperature won't be that much of a difference, however, for experiment's sake. We're sitting at 28 degrees right now with the white fabric. So what do we prove today? We proved that darker colors tend to absorb a lot more energy, which they turn into heat, and lighter colors tend to let a lot more light through, which cause a glare issue. But by adding a metalized back, you're able to get the best heat and glare control regardless of your color selection.